So we're here, or I'm here, on this Remembrance Day. And I'm in Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada. And uh, yes, I am the one who put that Twitter feed out on Don Cherry, on uh, his behavior, on immigrants, and not wearing poppies. And if I'm not mistaken, Don Cherry, this is directly to you. That tens of thousands of Canadians don't wear poppies on Remembrance Day. Not just immigrants. And you, Mr. Cherry, are a racist. A typical way of thinking conservative. Your beliefs are not everybody's beliefs in Canada, Mr. Cherry. I think a man of your age and your stature should know better. And when it comes to immigrants and it comes to Canadians, aren't very different. And the reason I say that is because 200 years ago, Canadians that came to this country were immigrants. So your comments are way out of line and very unprofound and unprofessional. And you should have taken responsibility and you should have said you should have said you're sorry and you didn't. You left that in the hands of Don McLean. Very sad. Today is today is November eleventh, twenty nineteen. Today is a day of remembering for those who've fallen, for those who didn't come home, who fought for the world, so the world wouldn't be left in chaos to somebody like Adolf Hitler. Six million souls died. And we have this sports commentator, color commentator, coach, ex-coach, who has the audacity not to keep his comments to himself. That's a very, very dangerous behavior. Very dangerous behavior. And if you don't believe me, look up his news feed, his sports feed on YouTube and be the judge for yourself. Judge for yourself. But it's times like this why I'm ashamed to be a Canadian. When it comes down to people like Don, Ch uh, Don Cherry. Very unprofound. Very unprofessional. And by not apologizing, by standing by his word, is showing that he's a racist. And I'm calling him out on that. It doesn't matter to me. I speak my mind. I'm indigenous. I have felt, seen, and been through racism for 47 years. So to me right now on this November, this Remembrance Day, remembering our fallen who died so we could live, shame on you, Don Cherry, and shame on CBC for airing it. That's my rant for today. My name is Philip Holmes, and I'm from Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada.